mid-90s St. Petersburg and look at the sky. It's amazing. This is the best time to visit St. Petersburg, Russia. Here I am. Geographically speaking, Russia is the biggest country in the world. And on this trip, I'm going to visit St. Petersburg and Moscow, the two main cities here. This is St. Petersburg, Russia's artistic and cultural center. For most of the 20th century, St. Petersburg was called Leningrad. It was a homage to Vladimir Lenin, a revolutionary and the first leader of the Soviet Union. It became St. Petersburg again in 1991. And I remember that. St. Petersburg is famous for Palace Square, the Hermitage Museum, the various historic buildings, the canals, and I'll show you all that in the next videos. Right now it's about 6 p.m. and we'll get ready for the evening. Tonight we're staying up until very late to find out why so many people fall in love with this city. Keep watching, you won't believe it. We're so excited, but let's settle in first. Architecture here is amazing, very European, very historical. Take your hotel, for example. Wow, look at this view. That's the Russian Museum, and over there, the Church of the Savior on Spilled Blood. Grand Hotel era represents all the cultural and historical beauty of St. Petersburg. The building itself is from the 1820s and the hotel is from 1875. It was a combination of the surrounding buildings here. So century after century, it just maintains the glamour. But the hotel also had some difficult moments during World War II. St. Petersburg was occupied and one third of the city was destroyed by bombs. Here they were even kind of lucky, just part of the hotel was destroyed. And as there was no tourism during the war, the hotel became a hospital. This room here was the operating room. During the Soviet times, Grand Hotel Europe was the meeting point for artists, musicians, and the elite in general here in Russia. Sometimes they used to come here even for their meals. So we're going to try one of these meals, and we chose the new restaurant, Asia. Is this here what I think it is? Is this gold? Already my favorite. Shrimp, soap, taste. Asian fusion dinner. We tried Japanese cuisine, Chinese cuisine, Indian. Oh, everything's so delicious. Chef Larissa, she was the one who prepared everything, all the delicious dishes we've just tried. Thank you so much, Larissa. That was amazing. Truly really amazing. <laughs> Thank you for your attention. Uh, <laughs> Thank you for your view. <laughs> I'm very happy. Me for you. No. I, I know something Russian. Spasiba. Yeah. Spasiba. <laughs> First time here in St. Petersburg, and I think I chose the best time of the year to come here. I'm here in June. It's because at this time there's something called White Nights. What it means exactly? Well, St. Petersburg is located very north on Earth. You know, in latitude, it's equivalent to Alaska. So at this time of the year, the sun never disappears 100% in the horizon. 
hence it doesn't get 100% dark. Everybody stays out, so let's go celebrate. We're doing a boat tour to see the famous white knights, but it's not only for the white knights. There's a reason they happen really, really late. You know, they never leave before midnight. It's because around one in the morning, it's when the bridges get open so that big vessels can cross. And it's a big deal here. It's a big attraction. sides of the river but go ready for the coat you know you guys saw how I started the tour look at how I'm finishing tomorrow we're going to visit some of the top attractions in town did you like the video then subscribe to my channel so that you don't miss the rest <laughs>